dear year course parents and families. It's amazing to think that we've been here for almost half of year course. And I bet you want to know what we've been up to. And all the while the weather is amazing. It's December and it's sunny. <laughs> but we haven't just been sunbathing, we have been doing worthwhile things. We are literally saving people's lives. And I'm saving turtles' lives. We've been working and volunteering with kids. We're even budgeting and buying our own food. We've been cooking and cleaning up after ourselves. Like every good Zionist leader, we've been working the land. This is worse than slave labour. The year course has been the worst experience of my entire life. Don't just take our word for it. See what my friends have to say. This morning we got woken up at 5.30 in the morning. We went in and had breakfast, made our lunches for today. We've been hiking since then. I've had the most unbelievable day, it's been the most unreal experience, something that I never dreamed of doing. I was really not considering doing Edgar Plus, but I'm so pleased I did because it's just been the most amazing experience and I've loved every minute of it. We've been hiking in the desert, stayed overnight twice already, we're just camping out tonight as well. Yeah. Me and my friend Jenna, we're ready to go on hike. We got up early, we filled up our water, anyway, we're going to get on the coach, the coach isn't there. Our coach has left without us and we missed the hike. <laughs> I'd like to say to my mum and dad, thank you so much for this opportunity and for letting me come to Israel and really experience how Israelis live. I'm really enjoying Kibbutz, it's, it's, de it's definitely a good option. You don't always have to go for the Marva, Marva, there's a lot of other options to go for. Them. Kibbutz is definitely a different way of life. It's not something I was looking forward to doing. I've never really wanted to experience Kibbutz, but since I have, it's changed my views a lot. I, c I can't believe I'm, it's gone so fast. The has gone so quickly. The highlight of the last few months in Israel is definitely being in Sfat for Sifat Torah. It's a great atmosphere all weekend, all Yom Tov, and it was really, really a lot of fun. I've always wanted to work with kids. I absolutely love them. They're the cutest things in the world. Like when you see them in the morning, you have to smile. You can't be in a bad mood. It kind of just lightens up your day and I absolutely adore them. It's like nothing I've ever done before. Very different. It's a great opportunity to do new things. <laughs> of people. The English is good. They speak to me and they speak well. Uh, I think uh, Sarah is very nice and I appreciate it. Teach us all, uh, all this. Chanukah, Chanukah, <laughs> Do you have the time to listen to me whine about nothing and everything all at once? Uh, your course has made me so much more independent. For the first three months in Bat Yam, we had to do everything ourselves. We had to walk to the supermarket, buy our food. We had to cook all our meals, clean, like, clean the apartments. It's a good feeling to be so independent and it's a nice change. 
I think it's it's very easy to learn more about Judaism here because they have some some great teachers and some great ways to learn more about Judaism. It all keeps setting up. I think I'm up. In the next six months, what I'm most looking forward to is doing things that I haven't done before. Spending much more time with the friends that I've made here and I'm hopefully looking forward to doing MADA. I thought at the time that MADA was really important. Um, now, however, I think it's infinitely more important. It aids the stability of the country and without the donations, MADA really couldn't run. I think this time on year course has, has given me time to think about my life, think about my values and what I want to achieve in the future. My message to all of the parents would be, you have given all of your children an amazing opportunity. You have allowed them to come to Israel for a year to experience, to study and to volunteer. And I really say thank you to each and every one of them. So far the I've learned more about the land, I've learned more about myself. It's amazing how everyone comes back, my brother was on it, friends have been on it, and they all say about how, yeah, of course you change, you know, and I'm seeing that happening already. Meeting new people and experiencing different things. The highlight's been definitely Friday night at the Kota with all of you, of course, all together. It was so amazing to see. Can't believe the third of my year's already gone. It's gone really, really quickly and it's all been amazing. I can't wait for the next six months. My connection with Israel has changed also over the past three months um, in that I have a stronger relationship with Israel. I feel completely at home in Israel. Thank you for sending me on your course. It's been an amazing experience. Thank you for letting me come here and not missing me that much and knowing that I'm having the most incredible year of my life. If I, if I had a message uh, to give to my parents, I'd just say thank you. My parents were here right now in Israel. I'd say thank you very much for giving me this opportunity. Uh, shawarma, falafel, two egg slime, oh. and the chips. Hi, I'm from Year Course and I'm still drunk from last night. Will you be needing any volunteers at this school? But we haven't just... No, again, again. Hey guys, let's go outside and practice it downstairs. No. <laughs> I would say to my parents that I'm having an amazing time and that I don't want to go back home. <laughs>